Welcome back to my channel. Today, in light of my new September holster review, I'm going to start off with a review on the Undertech Undercover Women's Compression Concealment Short Shorts. Now, these were one of the first holsters that I had ordered and they worked really well for me right off the bat. So I wanted to make sure to review them first because they're in most of my pictures and posts, they're in all of my videos, and I wanted to let you guys know what these short shorts are all about. Now they are called Women's Concealment Short Shorts. My favorite thing about these shorts is that, actually I have two favorite things, they fit a couple of, a bunch of different sizes of firearms and they make my firearms extremely concealable. They're compression shorts so they actually hug the firearm pretty close to my body which is really, really great. All right, so Let's take a look at these a little bit closer. So here's the box that they come in, and they actually come in a handful of different sizes. So they're really, really versatile as far as what shape and size you are. Now for most of us women out there, we've all probably experienced some sort of compression clothing or Spanx, and these are a lot like that. So if you had to get used to those, you'll be used to these really quick and easy. Um, they also come in three different colors. These are the black. And here's the white. You can see I've been wearing these and I did not wash them before the video. So you can see here there's um, some markings from where the firearm sits against my black pants. But they are really great. In the back is where the pockets are. There are two pockets. So they're actually, these, this holster is for right and left handed, which is really, really great. It's ambidextrous. I also flip them around and wear the pockets in the front which makes it really, really great because sometimes I don't like to small the back carry or it just doesn't work for my outfit and carrying them in the front makes, him, makes it a really great option for me. They are inside the waistband, so you wear this holster underneath your other clothing. Um, they're really great if you wear them underneath pants. They fit underneath skinny jeans. I've worn them under leggings and maxi skirts tight-fitted clothing. I also wear them underneath dresses, um, especially if I have short dresses that are just above the knee. With these short shorts, if I still want to conceal my firearm, I can wear it appendix or small of the back, and the, the draw will just be to lift up the dress. So they work really great for just about any kind of clothing. Uh, the cost of these are $59.99. Right now, that's the price of them on the Undertech Undercover website. For me, I feel like that price was definitely worth it when it came to this holster specifically. I wear these holster shorts almost every day. They're definitely one of my favorite right now. I like them because they offer so much versatility and by wearing them so often, it creates consistency with my holstering and my concealment. Now, as far as coverage, trigger protection, and retention goes, let me show you. So I actually have a handful of different sizes of guns here. Here's one of my uh, normal concealed carry firearms. It's the Springfield XDS 3.3. And depending on where you're gonna holster. So it actually has pretty good coverage when you put the firearm in the holster. You can see it covers the trigger. It covers the mag release. Um, it covers most of the barrel and slide here. Obviously you have some sticking out. I like that the handle is um, completely exposed so that when you go to grab it, you're just grabbing between your, your body and the firearm when you go to pull and draw. So it actually holds really well retention wise. These are really great, especially because it's a compression short. Not only is retention here pretty good, um, upside down I'm pretty sure it'll just fall out. <laughs> this gun is unloaded here, safety first. However, when they're on my body, I've actually exercised in these shorts um, they fit larger guns and smaller guns. So here's my Ruger LCP, and let's put that in there really quick. So it fits all different sizes of firearms really, 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 really well. You've got versatility. The compression on these shorts makes it great because it holds all sorts of, here's a Glock 19. It holds all different sizes of firearms extremely well and up against your body. Sweat protection, so the material, um, these are made out of polyester and spandex. So the material does a little bit of protection against sweat, so if you're wearing these for running or exercising, know your gun's probably gonna get a little bit 
damp, so you're going to probably have to clean it afterwards. There is not an adjustable cant or ride on these. Now, because they're shorts, you can obviously wiggle them down or wiggle them up on your body, but they're going to pretty much fit in one or two main spots on your body. Because they're compression shorts, they're going to hug your body where it wants to be hugged. Um, sometimes I have to adjust them. One of the things that actually I don't love about this, because they're made for the for the uh, holster pockets to go in the back, when I wear it in the front, where this harder seam is here, it hits the crease of my leg. So I've just had to get used to that being a slightly uncomfortable when it comes to wearing these in the front with my firearm, especially as you can see, if my firearm is here and I'm sitting down, now not only the crease of the shorts is in my leg, but the firearm is in the crease of my leg as well. So just make sure that you know you try these out. I think that they are extremely comfortable. Um, they're, as I said, in the waistband, so they don't take any belt clips. They don't need a belt. They don't need a clip. They are compression shorts. They fit right on your body. I usually hold my extra magazine in the extra pocket. One of the other things that I definitely am not in love with about these shorts is that when I sit down, the bottom of the shorts here, they kind of roll up underneath my clothes so it just takes a little bit of adjusting for the most part it's not the worst thing in the world when it comes to these shorts um it's just something you have to get used to just like almost any other piece of women's clothing out there so us ladies know the struggle as far as comfort goes on a scale of one to five i definitely give these like a four and a half the compression might take a little getting used to if you aren't used to compression clothing I don't love wearing compression clothes. I hate being confined in my clothes. However, these are actually extremely comfortable for compression shorts. The trigger coverage and protection is really, really good. Um, it's definitely protected really, really well. If you can see, so here's an unloaded LCP for you. No mag, nothing in the chamber. And if you try to pull the trigger, as you know this, as you may know, this firearm has a really long, stiff trigger pull. That's its safety. If you try to get in there, underneath these shorts Ugh, it took almost two hands to try to pull that trigger underneath this pocket so as far as trigger protection goes they have really pretty good um, protection for that ease of access it's extremely great they go the holster is right on your appendix or small of your back so I feel like that's one of the easiest spots for me to get to my holster the firearm pulls right out of this holster really, really well, and then the compression is what keeps it tight on your body so that it's not falling off of you. It's really great. So I give ease of access, probably a four and a half as well. Concealability, I think, is a five on these. These shorts hug almost any gun I have as close to my body as possible. When I wear these shorts with my Ruger LCP, this, this little gun disappears. It's completely gone. I can wear a maxi skirt with a tight shirt or a tighter fitting shirt and you can barely barely even see a bulge it's amazing so these shorts on concealability I'd give a five and on safety I'd give these probably a four just because um, the holster doesn't clip the firearm in however with retention on these this the firearm definitely stays in place uh, extremely well I've, I've exercised in these and it does a great job as far as weight of your firearm and how tight the shorts are on you, one other thing to consider is the weight of your gun. It may slightly sag depending on the size and how they fit you. I haven't had this issue because I got a pretty small size and so they're fairly tight and they compress really well against my body. So that's just something to consider when it comes to this holster as well. I hope that that was helpful for you all. I'm gonna go ahead and post the link below so you guys can find this. Under Tech Undercover, they provide a handful of other compression clothing items or just clothing concealment items. I will be doing a review on their women's leggings for you all in a couple of weeks too, so stay tuned for that. And I hope you enjoyed this. If you have questions or comments, please leave them below, and I'll see you all next time.